Hey, what's going on guys? It's Pat and welcome back to another mob battle. And today's fight is going to be the Hydra from Twilight Forest against the Ender Dragon. And people have been requesting this one forever. It actually might be the most requested battle of all time. And it really is possible too. The Hydra has 360 health and the Ender Dragon has 200. So he does have a bit of an advantage there. And all his moves, a lot of them are fire based, but they actually do do damage against the Ender Dragon, which is kind of surprising. The one annoying thing about this battle is, you know, he locks onto the player, even in creative mode. So what we're going to do is try to stay pretty far away during the fight. I do have OptiFine installed, so I can zoom in. Um, the Ender Dragon does knock him all over the place, so it's not that easy to do, though. So we'll see what happens with that. But be sure to leave a comment and let me know who you think is going to win this battle. And we will get it started right now. Here we go. Ender Dragon against the Hydra. Two bosses going at it. This is crazy. And yeah, right now, he's knocking him all over the place. And I'm even, like, too far away. He's, like, glitching out. You need to get close enough here. The Hydra is taking some damage, as you can see. And the Ender Dragon is just, like, charging at him. Really wants to win this battle. You can tell. He is going crazy. He's right behind him. Hydra's struggling because of that. He's trying to get in there. Come on, Hydra. Oh, he just shot him with fire right there. Which proves the Ender Dragon does take damage from fire. Although, he can't get, like, you know, lit on fire. He does not burn. But it's pretty crazy. I can't believe all his moves actually do do damage against the Ender Dragon. One thing is, he's extremely quick. So the Hydra does have trouble actually hitting him. And he's always, like, knocking him all over the place. Giving him an advantage in this fight. But these bosses are pretty crazy. I'm trying to zoom in right now. See, if I zoom, it's hard to, like, see everything. It's hard to, like, move it with the camera as I'm moving. Hard to tell where I am. But he is after him. And he's knocking him all over the place. He's shooting fire at him once again. The Ender Dragon is taking some damage. He is half down at this point. And yeah, every once in a while, it glitches a little bit when you're that far away. This is such a crazy fight. They're both about half down. And the Ender Dragon is after him. He has multiple heads now. He spawned in extra ones. Which is probably a big disadvantage for the Ender Dragon. Because more of them can actually, you know, hit him. Higher chance of getting him. Fire is getting, like, sprayed all over the place. The Ender Dragon is taking damage. But he is knocking the Hydra everywhere. He's got, like, freaking ten heads right now. This is so crazy. He's knocking him towards me. And, yeah, that's bad. I don't want to be that close to him. The Ender Dragon is down to 28, 23. Hydra is half down. It looks like the Hydra is going to take him down. Look at all those heads. It's just ridiculous. Oh, man. He's still knocking him all over the place, though. And the Ender Dragon is still down to 23. Can he finish him off? I can't believe this one was possible. I'm so excited to finally do this battle. It looks like he knocked off another head, but no! The Ender Dragon is dying. Oh, man. That was crazy, though. So intense. And the Hydra is pissed. He got about halfway down, but we're going to have to try that one more time to see what happens. All right, guys. It is time for round two. Can the Ender Dragon come back and win this time? Here we go. And let the round begin. It's pretty crazy. Just hit him with fire right there. Ender Dragon down to 195. And charging into the Hydra. It's so crazy. The thing is, he kills his heads and then he spawns so many. Like, he easily is able to damage the Ender Dragon after that. But I'd say right at the beginning, the Ender Dragon has a huge advantage. Because he only has three heads to attack with. He's, like, charging into him. Just knocking him away right now. He's trying to shoot at him. Oh, and he took some damage. I might be a little too far away. Sometimes, with the Hydra, if you're too far away, you don't see the attack animation itself. All right, he's really close now. Trying to shoot fire at him. Missed, like, horribly badly. Really bad shot. Oh, God. There he goes. Trying to hit him. And he took some damage right there. Hydra's barely taking any damage so far. And the Ender Dragon is down to 185. Circling around and going in for the kill. It's crazy that he knocks him, like, into the air on every single hit. It's pretty awesome because the Hydra is so freaking big, too. I can't believe he does that. But, of course, you know, he is the Ender Dragon. The Ender Dragon is awesome, of course. And the Hydra taking some damage here. Ender Dragon just knocking him over and over and over again. Let me zoom in here. Yeah, the zoom doesn't work that good with this battle because, you know, I'm constantly moving. It makes it, like, really hard to control my character and to see exactly where I am. Shoot and fire at him. Oh, and they all missed. Yeah, the Hydra just can't hit the Ender Dragon unless he has more heads helping him out. The Ender Dragon's moving around so much, and that's really the problem for him. All right, Ender Dragon. He's shooting right at him. Oh, and he missed once again. Yeah, that's the problem at the beginning of the battle. But once he's got, like, six heads out there, like, every single thing, you know, the Ender Dragon has nowhere to go. 
<laughs> but to take damage. Oh, man. All right. He's about to shoot at him. I think he's going to get him. Yeah, he did. Shot him with the fire right there. And we're just, like, chasing them all over the place right here. The Hydra has no chance right now. Ender Dragon really wants to win this round. He's attacking right now. He's taking some damage. Oh, man. He's shooting fire. Yeah, the Ender Dragon took damage, like, five times in a row right there. Ender Dragon, what health are you at? He's down to 113 already. And the Hydra really hasn't taken too much this time. He hasn't even killed one of his heads yet. Oh, he just hit him with a fireball right there. And I think he broke his first head. I think he did it. So two more should be coming in to replace it. Here we go. The Ender Dragon doing some damage. Ender Dragon's about half down, though. I mean, that's a big disadvantage for him because the Hydra has not taken too much damage so far. Yeah, he's got four heads. I think now that he's got four heads, he's going to have a big advantage in the fight and probably going to finish him off pretty quickly. But look, he's taking some damage from it. Come on, Ender Dragon. You got to move quickly. He's staring right at you. With like one head staring at him. He keeps knocking him and goes right behind him. When he's behind him, it makes it so much harder for him to hit him. He tries to turn his sense. Oh, God, he's coming right at me. He tried to back up here. They're all staring right at me. That's the only problem with this battle is that he naturally locks onto the player. And that's why I'm trying to stay pretty far away so that doesn't happen. Come on, Ender Dragon. All right, he's right at him. Right in front of him, too. Shoot some fire at him. And the Hydra is down to 254. And the Ender Dragon down to 98. 88. Just got hit by a bunch of fire right there. Oh, man. Come on, Ender Dragon. You can finish him somehow. I'd really like to see the Ender Dragon win a match, but it doesn't look like he's going to win a round. He's taking some serious damage. He's going to have to really, like, destroy the Hydra right now. He wants to have a chance in round two. If he does win this one, we'll definitely try a third round. If not, I think we're going to have to call it a win for the Hydra. Come on, Ender Dragon. He's shooting so much fire at him. Oh, the Ender Dragon went way down right there. He took some serious damage. Ender Dragon is down to you. I'm trying to like, gauge his health. Oh, he broke another head. That means more are coming. Yeah, I feel bad for the Ender Dragon now. He got hit by fire once again. Every time he gets hit, he takes a decent amount of damage too. Yeah, that's a lot of heads there. I think he's kind of screwed at this point. Ender Dragon, you have no chance. There are way too many heads on the Hydra. Oh, he broke another one, meaning two more will be coming. Yeah, every time the Hydra breaks a head... Two more replace it, so he gets, like, even bigger and more badass as the battle goes on. And I think he just broke another one again. Wow. And let's see. What's his health at? There's, like, ten heads after him. I want to see if he's almost dead. He's down to 11. He's probably going to die any second here. One more hit on the Ender Dragon. There's, like, three heads after him. Oh, man. He just avoided that. Oh, and he went right into it, and the Hydra finished him off. And yeah, he looks insane right now. Both times, got the Hydra about halfway down. But guys, it looks like the Hydra has won today's battle. I'm glad I finally was able to do this one, though. I've wanted to do it forever. Anyways, guys, hope you enjoyed the video. If you did, make sure to leave a like and to subscribe. And if you have an idea for a mob battle, leave it in the comments. Thanks for watching. I will see you next time.